All right, it's time for our book nooks segment. Brent Snyder's here to tell us what what all is the latest in books and DVDs man. and CDs, and you have a man, oh man, oh man, oh man. It 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 is it is just there's so much stuff out this week. It is just so awesome. It, it's it, Valentine's it, week. It so. is. There's a lot of gift ideas, but just stuff for yourself. Yeah. This week is all about me. You know, there's just great <laughs> things out here. What do you want to start with first? Um, let's let's start with things backwards this week. Let's start with the books. Great. Okay. Uh, you know James Patterson has literally a new book pretty much every week, right? Yeah. Well, just about. This is his new entry in his private series, which is about a private eye firm, and it's about Hollywood's hottest couple being kidnapped or were they murdered? We're gonna hope they're kidnapped because I don't want to, you know, deal right. with the sadness of a murder or anything. <laughs> but that's what it's about. Mm -hmm. They deal with it's kind of like Dynasty meets I don't know heart to heart or whatever. Any specific couple he's talking about? Uh, well, it's, it's always a fiction. It's a fictional couple, not a real okay. couple. Let's pretend that George Clooney got married to Brad Pitt's wife, Angelina Jolie. <laughs> Let's pretend that, or it could be Brad and Angelina, you know, it could be them as well. Yeah, I mean, okay. Who, I, can you think of anybody that's hotter than that as a, far as a, mar as a married couple? Uh, I don't know. No. no, you don't keep up with it? No. I don't either. Anyway, Moving but, on. but there's that. <laughs> okay, great, great kids book called Henry's Freedom Box. It's a true story of the Underground Railroad. Aww. And it's a great kids book, great art, um, but tells a really important story about, um, you know, smuggling um, slaves out of the slaves in, into the free states. And we're also doing a story time Saturday at noon, of course, this nice. week. Yeah. Uh, we'll, be, we'll be reading this and talking about it uh, with, the, with the kids. So it's at noon on Saturday. So okay. if you have kids, come on out for nice Henry's Freedom experience. Box. Nice Yes. Look. This is video game out. It's called um, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Basically, it's a pirates video game. Dude, mm -hmm. I love pirates. I love pirates and <laughs> Who Vikings, love pirates? right? And okay. uh, yeah, you know, pirates are hot again because there's, they a, there's, are. A, there's that new series on. It's also called Black Flag, but mm -hmm. it's not it's connected to this, to this thing. But Black Flag is a really good title. I hear that Depp's going to do another J uh, Captain Jack, you know, of uh, Pirates of the Caribbean of movie. Yes. And so pirates, you know, are, pirates are back for yeah. sure. Mm -hmm. And this is a great book of great concept art behind the video games. It's beautiful art. Imagine sailing a ship in the Bahamas. That's what the video game pretty much. Wow. Is. Of course, you go and you steal stuff too, but yeah, well, it's a lot of fun, right? Live a pirate life. Uh, yeah, yo ho ho. <laughs> have you heard of Divergent? No. Okay, there's a movie coming out of Divergent. It is inspired by a, um, a, a, a best selling teen series. They have re released the first novel of the series with the movie poster cover and hardcover mm -hmm. for those who want to get it as a gift. Imagine a, a future society where there's like five different attributes and you have to choose as a kid what you're going to be. Like, say you. So you chose to be a farmer when you were a kid, mm -hmm. and you come up. You want to be a newscaster. Too bad you can't do it. You got to be stuck in this role that wow. you're in, right? So that's not right. So, no. have, so the divergent is someone, I guess, who's trying to fight against that whole in the injustice of it all. Sounds We're very just, interesting. You know, yeah, a lot of fun. Yeah. I want to talk okay. about. I know this. you want to talk about that. <laughs> okay, look, there's not a lot of CDs out this week, but probably the best CD of the year has come out. Well, not the best CD of the year, but it's really, really important. It's the Lego Movie soundtrack. Right. Why is it important? Because Everything the number awesome. one song for kids to pick right now is called "Everything Is Which Awesome." Which you're looking Which, at right now. Yes, this is a super group of Tegan and Sarah with rapping by The Lonely Island and music by Mark Motherboat of Devo. And it's it's a great, great song. Um, it's a fun movie, fun soundtrack. Batman has a song on the soundtrack. <laughs> Seriously, Batman wrote a song. How can you pass that up? Wow. Right, right? Yes, yes, yes. If you like Legos, it's definitely... It's not just about Legos. It's no, about, I know. It's about life. No, seriously. The movie, basically, what it is, you know what it is? Life. It's a okay. spoof of The Matrix. It's a spoof of every oh, big really? blockbuster out there. It's just funny, 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 and the music is just delightful. Yes, you were doing your impression of a Lego earlier. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. And I, I will not be doing that again. You won't on do it. Oh, okay, no. well, you, you got a perfect one right there. <laughs> now, as far as DVDs go, everything out mm -hmm. this week is based on a, a, a classic book or a best selling series. It's amazing. BBC Sherlock, season three, is out right now. Very popular show, very well done. Basically, their TV seasons are like trilogies of movies. Mm -hmm. So this is like basically three feature length films about Watson and Sherlock. A lot of fun, great performances. A lot better in season two, in my opinion. But okay. that's just me. Yeah. Killing Kennedy is based on the best selling book by Bill O'Reilly, uh, where Rob Lowe is playing um, Kennedy. Now I was kind of skeptical, but you know he's not too bad, it, I've not seen too his, shabby. Okay. I thought it was pretty good. Yeah. And then there's. Uh, uh, I just drew a blank here. Uh, Ender's Game. Ender's okay. Game, yes. Based on a series of books. It's a future society. 
uh, aliens have attacked. The grown-ups just can't work technology anymore for whatever reason. They're terrible at it. So mm -hmm. what you do, you get the kids. The kids work technology. <laughs> Teach the kids to shoot laser, giant laser guns. And that's yeah. what it's about. Movie at the box office didn't do terribly well. Mm -hmm. Maybe it'll do better on um, DVD. I'll tell you, Harrison Ford is in it, but Ben Kingsley steals the show. Really? Sir Ben Kingsley is one of the best actors out there. He'll take a small role. His attitude is, did the check clear? He will do anything, <laughs> and he'll steal the movie. He was wow. in two scenes in Iron Man 3, and he stole the whole movie away. Really? Yeah. He's, hmm. he's great. He's okay. great. And he's willing to wear, like, face tattoos and, and funny makeup and stuff. Okay. Great well, character actor. That's great. All right. Well, as usual, thank you so much, and we look forward to seeing you next week. Well, there's much more to come on Southeast Texas Live. Stick around. We'll be right back.